Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many React Native developers encounter. Our viewer is trying to add a specific package from a GitHub repository, but it's not located where they expected. Let's dive into the details of their challenge. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To add a dependency from a subdirectory in a Git repository using Yarn, we first need to understand the structure of the repository. In this case, the package we want is located in the packages jest enzyme subdirectory. Since running the command yarn add dev ash github.com slash life is content slash enzyme dash matchers dot git installs the entire repository, we need a different approach to target just the subdirectory. One effective solution is to use the file protocol in yarn. You can clone the repository locally and then specify the path to the subdirectory in your package.json. After updating your package.json, run yarn install to install the dependency from the specified local path. This way, you can access the package without any import errors. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To add a dependency from a subdirectory in a Git repository, try referencing the submodule path directly. For example, you can import it like this, import jest enzyme from enzyme nash matcher slash packages jest enzyme. Keep in mind that if you're using Lerna to manage a multi-repository project, the sub-packages only provide source code. You'll need to build or compile them before use. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To add a dependency from a subdirectory in a Git repository using Yarn, you can use a service called Git PKG. Just format your command with the Git PKG URL. And that's it, guys. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until next time, I hope you have a good day and see you then. Cheers.